Hey guys, this is Matt Laporta with Laporta Sports. Today we're going to talk a little bit about um, your pregame approach during batting practice. Now I understand some of you guys might not be able to hit on a field before a game, you know, like you do in the minors or in the big leagues. I'm assuming some colleges um, and, and travel ball, maybe that you get to you get that opportunity. But really, it can apply to whether you're hitting on the field or whether you're hitting in the cage. Uh, my approach was something that kind of developed over time and, and the way you go about it is going to develop over time but it's really important for you to get a routine that you're comfortable with um, for your batting practice routine because that's just a part of your game that you need to get comfortable with and feel great about right you don't need to be working on too many things during batting practice before the game um, it's it's more of a routine as part of that structure that gives you confidence to go into the game and be successful you know i, I know guys like barry bonds would get in you know, he would be feeling so good at times where he would take four or five balls and, and he would feel great and he'd walk out of the cage and he'd be done. I'm not saying you go out and do that, right? I'm just saying that it's, it's about more of a mental side of the game as opposed to that physical side, I think. Um, so my routine, what I would do was I'd really try to, to, to work through the middle of the field, kind of that first round. Um, stay focused on hitting, you know, line drives right through the middle of the field, right through the uh, L screen would always be my goal. And then, you know, we kind of would, would uh, let the ball travel a little more and, and hit it to right center the next round. Next round, try to go left center. We'd mix in there, um, you know, maybe a round of, of, you know, moving the runner. We'd do some situational work. I think it's important for us as hitters to not just go out and hit during batting practice but have a mindset of what we're doing. Hey guys on third, infields in, I need to get the ball elevated, right? So what am I looking for? I'm looking for a ball that's up in the zone. Or hey guys on third, uh, no outs, I gotta get this guy in, infields back. Let's get on top of something. So maybe look at a ball that's kind of uh, a lower ball so you can hit a ground ball somewhere. So it just situational things like that. And we'll go over situational hitting in, in other videos. Um, but right now it's more about that kind of pregame routine uh, on hitting. So again, depending on how many you get, a lot of teams will do five or four rounds or five rounds of five to seven balls. And so I've already given you three rounds. So I've given you back up the middle, right center, left center. So the next one I'm going to give you is kind of that fourth round. By now you should be feeling good and, and ready to kind of unload a little bit here. And so this is the one where, I, you know, let, let's drive the ball. You know, my objective was let's drive the ball out of the ballpark to dead center, right? I know that's not everybody's objective. Um, and I'm not saying my way is the right way, the perfect way. There's other guys that hit totally different than that and they do fantastic, right? It's just, it's more about you thinking about what is my routine? How do I get in a routine? Um, and so again, and so then in the, in the fifth round we go through and we're going to just kind of, you're, we're going to stay back through the middle, maybe left center, turn on a couple balls. You know, it's good to feel that, you know, it's good to feel you turning on a couple balls. But again, not spinning off of the ball, staying through the ball uh, and driving that baseball. And so that kind of would round out our, our batting practice pregame uh, routine.